I should check on Miles. Hey, Pete, you okay? That's what I was gonna ask you. I'm fine, but you and May are in the middle of it. We're busy, but people need help. And I'd rather be doing something than waiting around for somebody else to fix things, you know? Yeah, I heard that. Just make sure you protect yourself. Mask and gloves. And rest every now and then. All that goes double for May. <sighs> Nobody can make that woman take a break when she doesn't want to. But I'll do my best. Thanks, Miles. Give May my love. And be safe. There's the reservoir. No sign of Scorpion. Better take a closer look. Now, if I was a mercenary dressed like a Scorpion, where would I be? Behind you! Me, I'd end it now. But Octavius is paying, and he wants to torture you, which I respect. Damn it! What did he inject me with? Whoa! What the... Is that... a sea of poison? Can't be! This can't be real. It must be the poison. But I can't take any chances. Gotta get to higher ground, and analyze whatever he injected me with. Should be safe for a minute. We need to analyze the neurotoxin so I can create an antidote. Scorpions made some upgrades. Hallucinogenic neurotoxin. My brain will create nightmares that my body thinks are real. I have to create the antidote fast. First, I need a natural steroid. Extract from an Eclipta Alba plant should do the trick. ESU's greenhouse is nearby. Hope it's in season. There's the greenhouse! Eclipta Alba should be inside the greenhouse. There it is. Is that Is she duck? It's just the hallucinations intensifying. You can get through this. Doc, you sound... Like I did before the neural interface affected my mind. My obsessions were always there, but the interface allowed me to fully embrace them. I have to fix this. Fix you! Somehow! Ah, uh, Peter. Always trying to shoulder the responsibility, even when there's no hope. I can't tell you how many times your unfettered optimism has kept me going when things look bleak. I'll miss me with you. I really will. I'm sorry, Doc. I'm so sorry! Yes, yes, you're sorry. And yet, you let it happen. Makes one wonder where your priorities lie. I mean... If I was really that important to you, why would you let me destroy myself? I can help you. It's the neural web. It's affecting your mind. You mean the neural web you helped create. The hard truth is you did this to me. Without your help, I would have never done any of those terrible things. I should have seen what was happening to you. Never left you alone with those arms. Good luck. I wish I could offer you more help. Stay strong, Peter. There's the Eclipto Alba. Ah! I need to find the time. But 
I need an antitoxin to mix a permanent antidote. One of Harry's research stations was developing a synthetic atropine. Gotta get there fast. Two deadly scorpions. Lovely. Thanks, Brain. Too late. Just as you were too late to help me. This isn't you, Doc. Ah, but it is me. The me polite society found inconvenient. The parts of myself I suppressed. But you helped me break those chains. I'm sorry. I'll find a way to help you. I swear it. Stop deluding yourself. You never help anyone. You are the poison! Everyone you touch suffers! Stop running from me! Let me try! I want nothing from you! You're a failure at life, love, career. You bring nothing but pain! No, stop! I'm not giving up on you! Just talk to me. I can help you. So you can treat me like all the rest. Containing me, suffocating me. No, I will let my genius shine on its own. I saw you, Peter, taking notes and stealing ideas. A rat in my own lab. To think I called you a friend. I am your friend, Otto. Please. I've always supported you. I always will. There it is. The atropine.
not gonna be that easy. Sure it is. Now I know you're the poison trying to distract me. Put one down. You're a loser. All you'll ever be is a loser. Can't let him get to me. To hit him isn't working. The world will be better off without you. And nice. Just a few more left. Another one down. So, one more. Barely stand up. There's the equipment I need. Finally, I'm running out of time. I can feel it. I think I did it. Where'd my suit go? I think I took decontamination a little too far. I'd better put some clothes on. Much better. Let's just go ahead and forget that ever happened. Whew. It's still foggy. Need to work the last of this poison out of my system before I tackle the other villains. Good time to go on patrol. MJ, hey, you mind if I toss a kind of thorny ethical question at you? When is it okay to give up on a friend? Oh, wow, Pete. Thinking of Otto? Is that obvious, huh? Yeah, understandable, though. Man, the high-minded, generous part of me wants to say never. Being a true friend means being there, even when people lose their way. But with what Otto's done, I just don't know, Pete. I guess you have to decide if the Otto Octavius you knew was still in there or not. If he was ever even in there at all. Yeah. Yeah. Thanks, MJ. I gotta process some stuff, I think. Call me anytime, Pete. I'm here for you. You say you wanna cry, but you never...